Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, well, a um, security flaw, including one that impacts Windows 11, is uh, has been found and uh, this is an interesting flaw and I wanted to talk about it because a lot of you came back to me saying, should I be worried about, they call it Serious Sam and the reason is it's because it's um, a bug that gives access to the registry um, database, basically. So the registry database files are uh, separated in several categories. And one of them, SAM, is um, of course has all the informations and keys in the registry database. Uh, what happens is that in Windows 10 and in Windows 11, this is something that can be um, exploited, but it's a local flaw. So that means it's a zero day. It is something that is pretty bad, but it can't be exploited without access to the physical, uh, physical access to the PC. So although it's serious, it is not as bad as a remote code execution that you can easily take over the computer. Um, this affects Windows 10 versions released since 2018, and of course it affects Windows 11 also. And uh, the attacker uh, basically would install a program and so on. Uh, there's a workaround available, but honestly I would not do anything because um, since it's not something that is an online flaw of the registry, um, what I would say is just, you know, be careful what you do. And um, it's, it's, it's all right for now. The, uh, as you see here, so there's different categories. And when you want to um, actually get into different, some of these different uh, categories each have their own database for the registry. So that's uh, what is exploited here. So um, what happens is that a, um, a change in the security and the, the way that the folders can be accessed, which is something that a lot of people are wondering why it happened, because it wasn't always the case. But now, even if you are in a uh, standard account, not even an admin account, you actually have access to the system, security, SAM, default, and software uh, config files that are in System32, which is kind of weird, considering that maybe, you know, that shouldn't be the case. So because of that, you can pretty much do what you want because you have access to the full registry and you can modify it, you can do um, as you please, and this is where the danger is. So um, I would tell everybody that is afraid of this flaw, and even in Windows 11, Windows 11 might have a fix actually with a, a cumulative update soon. But um, you know, it's I don't think it's bad enough that they'll uh, necessarily issue um, a, a quick patch to it. Although we don't know, you know, we don't want to have, of course, zero day flaws on our PC. But um, since it's something that is a local exploitation and not online, um, I would think that they are going to wait till patch Tuesday of August to fix this. So this apparently since 2018. So another flaw that has uh, been around for a while, but recently discovered. So I wouldn't worry too much. You know, if you're careful with your PC, if you uh, don't download illegal stuff and click on everything you see or attachments that you don't know where they come from, um, I mean, you should be relatively safe, even with this flaw in Windows. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.